Well, let me introduce you before you start taking your clothes off. <laughs> All right, and now it is my pleasure to introduce to you the PID current world champion, Betty Nude. Yeah. Shake a leg at that. I need to pee, but it's the fabulous, most groovy, New York City rock and roller ultra live in Los Angeles. And I'm close enough to take a whiff of his pant legs, baby. That's right. Tonight, the rock and roll daddy sweats his liquid charisma and silver pants and sequins. He got the flavor like to drive me wild. Hardcore loving, crazy style. His hyper mad Genetic seduction lubricates my legs. My pussy pulsates from its cocksure shock waves. Primal rhythms create such a suction. Can't quite say how I get up on stage. Face to face, he lets me breathe his blues. It's an explosion, baby. Like sucking the live wire wet. It shakes my heart. Makes my titty nipple stand up and say, yeah, hell fuck yeah. Crown queen of the palace, baby, with one silver smooth rock star kiss. Now somebody help me, please. I'm all soaking wet. Yeah. All right. I got wet. Just John Harris. <laughs> ah, John Harris, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen. I got wet seeing every last one of you. Yeah. Flee. <laughs> So I'm hauling ass while stucco boxes with their sun-raped lawns smear past. I slip down an alleyway where sour dogs bark. My bouncing soles beat the dirty under trash and every breath burns my lungs. I'm pumping, pumping hard as a man. Pasty sweat sticks my eat this t-shirt tight against my chest. Intermittent strokes of my lashes fling stinging splashes that blur chain link fences away. A newly shaved a newly shaved head allows me to fly. I really notice the wind. Soaring boot stomps back onto black top. I stop. Spin my round, throw my hands in the air, and yell, What in the hell am I running from anyway? It couldn't be when my dad was bigger and I wore his jacket and made me feel safer than when he was in his arms. It couldn't be what waits for me, the inevitable battle against gravity. I know Earth's power wins ultimately. Sucking in air and rubbing my stubble, I'm perched on the edge of insight eager to dive into the knowledge when something in my gut or maybe my head screams, go! And I split, man. I book. I found tobacco on my tampon. <laughs> Woke up drunk again this morning, roomy-eyed with a wet cough and stiff nipples. Watched him pee through two mirrors. God damn, what a beautiful man. Smokes the same cigarettes as me. I have lost my purse, and damn it, I keep two rubber frogs in there for the little ones. He had two babies, then waited for me. Waited hours without smoking. Dang, he loves my guts. My life is in shambles, yet woke up and had to dance. I found him when he was lost. He found my purse at the Salvation Army. My lighter is down there somewhere, but cigarettes are not sustenance. I found a tampon open at the bottom of my purse. Jake, I want to. Jake, she wants that Jake, handheld mic. I want that mic down there. Get, get on the mic. I'm just holding it. No. <laughs> you hold it. <laughs> you just stand there holding it for me. <laughs> Does it sound good? Or yeah. Can you yeah. hear it? That's going into the. That's not going into the PA. It's not. It's not gonna be cutie louder. That's yeah, gonna be oh, 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 that's fine. I just want to hold it. It just looks pretty. <laughs> yeah. 
suddenly last summer. Miss Catherine scattered, babbled. He had this explosive energy about him. He was lost, he was fine, and he sang the best lullabies. Every morning at low tide, he would carve this into wet sand. I've housed a Venus flytrap. I've watched blackbirds eat baby sea turtles. I've seen the face of God. I swear to God I've a mind to bottle up and go, make an opium run to Slab City, landlocked, trapped, safe, she cried, before all that freedom and all those beaches and that poem he wrote. Bad behavior. <laughs> <laughs> I know you poured your tea dregs in my porch palm. No witnesses, but I know what you did. I know I poured you a lightly sweetened iced tea in a chilled Tom Collins glass with a stainless steel homemade straw. Why? Because you are a friend. It seemed like you were chewing gum. You were not. You were parched. You were thirsty no more. Kisses, hugs, goodbyes, you were gone. Shards of glassy ice chips in a clump in her dirt, shocking her palp pot-bound soul, getting her all hopped up on caffeine. I had to douse her with tepid water to dilute your devious behavior. No witnesses, maybe, but rest assured, you will be punished. Jeez, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Can I go some more? Go, man, go. go. Keep doing daddy -o. Can I go? Okay. Actually, I don't like this. Yeah, anymore. we'll get that. He's laid on the ground. <clears throat> Stop it off. Yeah. <laughs> if you like this one? <laughs> if you don't like me, don't love me. Don't stick stuff inside me. When I trip, don't trip. Don't touch the hand of my clock. I will clean your clock, mister. Mop the floor with you. No more sexy secrets tonight. I don't want to play. Don't rub me the wrong way. I pray for sleep. Don't twist my words, wring their little necks. Don't staunch my strength or critique my tone. Leave my precious tongue alone. Don't stoke my ire. And please, for Christ's sake, don't hold that cigarette so close to your notebook. Stop <laughs> <laughs> it off. Stop it off. you. <clears throat> Spritz the garlic, darling, as you exit the courtyard. Close the gate with grace. Above all, deny everything. Thank you. He poured his tea dregs for Wendy and Aunt Gertie. The story of how he poured his tea dregs into her porch palm, for if he to her did pour his tea dregs into her porch palm, that story of which did happen, he poured his tea dregs into her porch palm. Not accidentally, when he saw the palm was dry. Perhaps not often again would he to her pour his tea dregs into her porch palm. He did not usually, when he saw the dry palm, pour his tea dregs into her porch palm. This could happen not without her porch. Everybody finds on it a plant that pleases them. He poured his tea dregs into her porch palm. <laughs>